hello everyone my name is pitham paul and welcome to my youtube channel in this video i am going to talk about the postgresql installation and setting up into the windows 11 okay so for that you need to go to the browser i'm using the brave browser here because it's more safer which i think and uh, other also pops are there you can use any browser and there you need to search by postgre sql now after going to that page you will find a link which is postgresql.org click there open the website and there you will find a download button so go to the download here as i am using the windows 11 obviously so windows otherwise you can use solaris mac or linux whatever it is you want yeah now that download the installer and then windows uh 32 or 64 bit option as i already downloaded it that's why i'm not going to download you guys download it and then uh, pause the video and then continue from there so here i have downloaded the postgresql into the downloads folder to install it you need to double click press yes and then it will take some time to install so let's just wait for that and uh, try to follow the steps as the way i am showing you okay pray next this is the default location all this thing you need to download oh, sorry install and then next again next again next so setup is newly ready so now the installation part is happening so i am fast forwarding it so that the time would be consumed please ensure the pg admin server should shut down before proceeding with the upgrade okay so this thing won't be coming into your case because you will be downloading and installing for the first time as i downloaded and installed and used postgresql that's why these kind of things are coming actually okay so the installation is going on so it has been downloaded so let's finish and then we need to choose this one the next so downloading the application list so it is coming you need to download only the database driver which is this one the updated one okay so uh in the data so it is there no need the next only this one you need to install okay so installation is going to start i guess yeah so yes almost is done okay so installation is complete now what now go to the settings all apps in windows everywhere is there go to the p and there you will find the postgresql go to the shell okay so open the shell here this is the server localhost press enter database is postgres port is 5432 and then username and uh, sorry username is this and there is a password so as i have installed second time in my computer that's why the password and all uh, has not been asked by, uh, to me but in your case there would be a password section will come for sure give the password in such a way that you could remember it very easily in my case i'm just giving the password and see the postgresql has been open up now if you write uh, backslash l see all the databases are showing so in the, this is the confirmation that uh, the postgresql has been installed properly and uh, i hope you like this video if you really like the video then please hit the like button and also let me know in the comment section for any kind of query or suggestions and subscribe the channel for sure and press the bell icon so that uh, every video which i would be uploading in future would be reached to you through notification this much for today guys see you in the next video